Rachel is going to be all right. The knife damaged her brachial artery, but didn't cut it. She's out of surgery, and now she's resting. Chloe, what happened? It's my fault. I should have listened to you. Sarah's mixed up somehow with this psycho Damon Merrick. I know exactly who Damon Merrick is. Start over and tell me everything. Did you and Rachel try to contact Sarah? I'm not going to chastise or blame you, Chloe, but I need the whole story. So I got my dealer to meet us since he knows Sarah. Frank Bowers. Yeah, that's right. But Damon showed up with him. What did Merrick want? He asked us why we were so interested in Sarah. And what did you say? No, nothing of course. Is that how it became violent? It was, it was actually Rachel who got angry. She was furious that he wouldn't tell her where Sarah was. This is exactly what I've been afraid of. Rachel won't let anything stop her. It wasn't only that. She was already angry about Damon pushing me around. She is like her mother. Quick-tempered, rash. I've always been afraid of losing her the way I lost Sarah. What happened next? Damon had a knife out. And we all could see it. But then he said something that pissed Rachel off. And she just grabbed a piece of wood and hit him. And then he stabbed her. I keep thinking that maybe I could have done something. But... When he attacked her, I just froze. It's not your fault. And Frank held him off so we could get to the truck. I heard a scream. But I don't know what happened. And then we were here. I appreciate you telling me the truth. What are you going to do about Damon? Find out if he is alive. First of all, my department's been after him for some time. I was told that if Rachel had arrived only a few minutes later, she might not have... Um... Thank you, Chloe. You saved my world. It will be some time before Rachel wakes up. I promise. I'll let you know when she does. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> hey. Steph, how's Drew? <sighs> Pretty good. Miss Amber just told me Rachel's going to be okay. <sighs> I'm really glad. Yeah. Well, our room's just down the hall. You should come by. Okay, sure. 
Definitely. I don't think I can sit still any longer. Might as well stretch my legs while I wait for Rachel to wake up. Hey. Just heard the fire went out. Went out. Why has my son been assigned to you? I never authorized that he be seen by. I was assigned because Nathan was becoming quite upset. So they sent a psychiatrist because my son was upset. <sighs> Holy shit. Please, Mr. Prescott, your son needs serious psychiatric. My son needs nothing from you. He put down a couple If I want to stay sane, I need to stay busy. School. That is What's there to do around here? Sir, I believe your son is manifesting serious and alarming symptoms. Allow me the chance to... Nathan's already getting more than enough attention from one of you. I am fed up with these made-up problems. Chloe, I can't even express thank you so much. I'm sorry. I'm a wreck. I stepped out to get some air. Rachel doesn't need me crying in front of her. Your hair. I almost didn't notice it. Oh, yeah, it's, it's not a big deal. I bet Rachel loves it. I can't imagine what I would do if we lost her. Me too. You've grown so close, haven't you? Yeah, it's Weird to think we just met a few days ago. When you meet someone who changes everything, you just know. Well, hang in there, Mrs. Amber. I will. I hope Everything Drew's doing better. Fire has been I, I should visit him. All right, then. Thank you. Hi. Mr. North? That's me. And you are? I'm Chloe. You here to see Drew? Yeah. How are, uh, how are things going? Oh, you know how it is. Ups and downs. You know, Drew's hurt, of course. But, uh, I'm between jobs, so got plenty of time to visit, you know? Yeah. Hold on. You said you were Chloe. Mikey's mentioned you a few times now. I have a question maybe you can answer. Sh sure. Both of those boys have been acting a little, well, guilty lately. Yeah, I I've been spending most of my time looking for work. I'm worried I missed something important. Do you know if anything's going on with them? Uh, no. Sorry. This weekend was actually the first time I really hung out with them. That's all right. I appreciate that you've been keeping my boys company. 
Drew's got so many hopes for himself riding on that knee. It seems like he's been even more driven lately. I think my work situation's disappointed him. Both of them. Actually, in different ways. <sighs> Sorry I'm laying all this on you. I've been trying to keep it light in there. That's okay. Uh, nice of you to listen. Do me a favor. Don't worry either of them with... Oh, excuse me. Rachel's waiting for me. Shouldn't stay here too long. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Drew. How's your knee doing? Do they think it's gonna heal? Uh, I'm not sure, actually. It's too early to tell. Sorry to hear it. It's, it's all good. Hmm. <laughs> Love the hair, by the way. Pretty cool. Thanks. <laughs> just, uh, trying it out. Sometimes you've just got to do something new. Hey, any news about Rachel? Her mom seemed hopeful. She just woke up. I'm going to see her soon. How'd she get hurt? You'll think I'm joking when I tell you, but I'm not. What happened? She got stabbed in the arm by demon fucking Merrick. Seriously? It, it wasn't because of me, was it? No, not at all. If anything, I should have thought about what happened to you before getting Rachel involved. That's crazy. Fuck that guy. I wish I could get my hands on him. Drew, chill out, okay? Uh, I'm headed out. Everything okay in here? Yep. Yeah. Don't have too much fun now. Try to keep it appropriate for the hospital. Bye, Dad. See ya, Pops. Man. Maybe... I shouldn't have mentioned Damon. Rachel's waiting for me. Shouldn't stay here too long. Hey. Sorry for losing it there. It's nice of you to come by. Feel better. I, I mean, no pressure. I, I know it's gonna take a while. You know what? I'm kind of tired. Oh, oh, right, right. I'll um, I'll leave you alone. Drew's been in a lot of pain today. All right. I'm gonna head out. It was really great to see you, Chloe. Agreed. Don't be a stranger, okay? Yeah? Tell Rachel we're rooting for her. You bet.
Pat. I'm glad that you're here. Me too, Rachel. It really hurts. Shh. The pain will pass. Chloe's here. You want me to stay? No. I'll be okay. Thanks, Dad. I'll come back in a little while. My guardian angel. How are you? Not great. Better with you here. Rachel, I'm sorry. What? What for? You're here because of me. Because I choked back there in the junkyard. What? Shut up. You were so fierce and I, I just froze. God, I fucked it up. I'm so sorry. And, and you saved my life. You saved my life. I almost lost you. I can't believe I almost... You're not getting rid of me that easy. Good. Happy that your dad's here. I mean... I'm still mad at him. For everything he's done. But... It felt so good to lean on him. He's my dad, you know? I felt completely safe. Like, on Mount Hood. <laughs> Would you do something for me? Anything. Sarah. My mom. <laughs> it's so weird to say. I'm not even sure what she is, honestly. But <laughs> I think I still want to meet her. Are you sure? She could be completely different than you imagine. I'm sure. I don't even know if she's still in Arcadia Bay. But if she is, will you find her, please? You really want this. Don't you? I do, Chloe. I really do. Then, of course. Whatever it takes. I bet my dad has her number. Maybe in his office. Our house keys just under the mat. The code is zero seven two two to your your dad's office zero seven two two yeah my birthday i'll find her rachel and then i'll i'll tell her how fucking cool you are Thank you, Chloe, for everything.
Uh, hey, Elliot. Hey! Wait, your hair, it's different. <sighs> yeah, yeah. I like it. It's, uh, it's nice. I like your shirt, too. I didn't know you were into dragons. Who the fuck isn't into dragons? Sorry I bailed on seeing the Tempest with you. The whole thing just sort of... happened. Uh, no. Not, not a problem at all. So... What's going on with you? Uh, I don't even know where to start. At the moment, I'm... here for Rachel. What? Rachel's here? What happened? Uh... She... got stabbed... by a psycho. Oh my god. Yeah. It was... insane. Holy shit. Wait, are, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. She's fine too, by the way. Are you, are you two in some kind of trouble? You can tell me if you are, you know. I won't judge. I'll make sure to keep you posted. Right now, I'm here to take care of Rachel. Chloe! I'm seriously worried about you. Well, don't be. Uh, I mean, you're hanging out with Rachel Amber a lot lately, right? So what? So, obviously, something is going on. I swear, man. Everything's really okay. Okay. I trust you. Just remember I'm here, okay? If you suddenly need something. Thanks. Anyway, see you around. Yeah. See you around, Chloe.